Hello my spooky friends of the internet and welcome back to another episode of 31 Days of Halloween. Today I want to show you all a few more items that I got to decorate the house with and they're very very little like minuscule things that I got and one of the things is has to do with this room <laughs> that I'm in that is very dark because this is the light and look at that. Yeah, it's not a very good light. Well, to be to be fair, it's actually supposed to be like a candle light, so it's totally my fault. That you can kind of tell that it like flickers. Anyways, but she is going to be featured. This live, laugh, love stuff is about to be gone for Halloween. I'm very excited about it. So for starters, to do with the wall border, um, I got these from the Dollar Tree. I actually got these last year too, which is these skulls and like, it looks very dungeon-esque. <laughs> and I got them last year. I really, really liked them actually a lot. And I hate this live, laugh, love stuff so very much, but I have yet to deal with it. I have yet to get these tools or whatever I need to get the wall border off and also just repaint these walls. This section of our house is very much like, I forget about it and I don't care that much. So, but for the Halloween party, <laughs> she's gonna have these and I'm very excited, but Cody's gonna have to help me because I did this by myself last year and it was so much work. My arms were sore for days afterwards. <laughs> So he's helping me this year. Then I also, um, I got these. <laughs> I got these from Big Lots the other day and it's just little plastic, uh, little rats. <laughs> I got these because I thought it'd be kind of funny to just have them around the food during the Halloween party, you know? I don't know why. I just thought they were kind of cute and like they were only $4 for 10 mice, but I will say they stink so bad. Like they smell like the most chemically plastic you could ever imagine. So I'm not gonna let it touch the food, but just kind of lay it around the counter for the Halloween party. <laughs> and then when we went to Spirit Halloween, I also got this guy, okay? Look at that, a window cling that is of Michael Myers, obviously. I have no idea where I'm gonna put him though because I feel like he looks so cool in a window or like a mirror or something, but uh, I just don't think I have any windows where he would make sense because the only windows I have are the back door, but he's cut off here, so I don't know how I can make him look super scary. Yeah, I can't have him jut out to the side because that, that just looks, <laughs> that looks stupid. But, uh, and then the other windows are too high up and I never open up the blinds, <laughs> so there's no way people are gonna see him. And then all my mirrors, I think, are either too small. So, I don't know, we're gonna have to figure him out. Uh, I have no idea what we're gonna do with him yet. And then really quickly before we get into our wall border, I want to show you all the plates and napkins that I got this year for the Halloween party. And I ordered this massive pack, okay? And it was way cheaper to buy this massive pack than it would have been to buy like uh, some paper plates at Big Lots. So I ordered these and now it came with these dessert plates. Like how cute little bats on them. I don't know why, I just love this vibe this year. I don't know why I can't talk today, I'm so sorry. I just love this vibe <laughs> this year. I don't know why, she's giving me like haunted vampire or something. Um, and then these are the napkins. It came with two packs of napkins and then two packs of those dessert plates. And then we also have two packs of the dinner plates, which are actually, they're kind of deep. You can kind of see, which is nice. So they feel like they're pretty good quality. I hope they are, but. Yeah, I got two packs of those. This also came with some cups. I have no idea where they are in my house though. <laughs> They're somewhere, hopefully. But it also came with cups and then some black forks as well. So it was actually a really good pack. So I just wanna let you all know that. Okay, now back to our wall border here. Now last year, all I did was place it up where I needed it to go and then I taped it. Um, and then the corners, oh my gosh, all these corners were the hardest part. And then Cody came in with an X-Acto knife and he cut around the vent there, which is another thing that is like really difficult. My problem is that I'm too short, you know? And I have a little step stool, but she doesn't really help matters that much. <laughs> so hopefully Cody is gonna save the day today. Oh my gosh, it smells so plasticky, but it's okay. But like, look at how much comes in it. Oh my, see it's still going. Still going. Wow. 
That's actually so much for just a dollar. I mean, I know it's like cheap plastic, but once you have it up, it really doesn't look that bad. Okay, I shouldn't have unraveled it because now I'm like, <laughs> made a mistake. Whoopsie. All right, we have our little helper here. <laughs> here to help. I'm here to help. Look at my bats. They're all messed up. There's like a bunch on the floor because they won't stay. They're so annoying. Yeah, I don't, well, we stopped trying. I know, they're so annoying. This is what we're putting up. Oh, fuck. on the wall border okay so last year we put it up and then I just taped like this end and then I put it over there and cut it off and then taped and then you just go around and do this whole entire thing <laughs> what's really exciting about you being here Me? is that last year I did it and I am still too short even with a stepping stool so it was you mean this stepping stool right here? It was, yeah, but you're way taller than me, so it would be way better for you. Wow, now that looks good. <laughs> Alright, we're done. Pain without love, pain. I can't get Another enough piece. pain. There's a P recess of pain. From last year. Pace of pee. God <laughs> damn. It's a a pretty ass pace of pee. <laughs> that hammer's are small, baby. I'm oh, sorry. What am I gonna do with this? <laughs> Think I'll stick to nothing. Macaroni cheese. Macaroni cheese. <sighs> well, so we did arms at the gym. <laughs> so this hurts. Yeah. Wow, we're like halfway. I Not really. Okay. All right, we are finally finished. Here is the final product. And then Cody cut out where the vent is. And it's looking pretty good, actually. I like it a lot. What was this, like $3? That's not bad. <laughs> $3, get rid of live, laugh, love, you know? All right, baby. Right. All right. I was like, I wish we could change that whole thing out to something permanent, but. Yeah, well, we do, we need to. The only part of our house we haven't remodeled is this kitchen and this area as well. So like you can even tell that the ceiling needs to be repainted, the walls need to be repainted, and we need to get rid of that border, but this is okay for now. <laughs> okay, I think I'm officially done Halloween shopping now. Thank God! <laughs> no, I mean, don't well, we I see think, the clearance section for next year. I think this is the last of Halloween decor that needs to be put out minus the fog machine for the Halloween party, but like mm, I'm not gonna get that specific, out. Yeah. I'm not gonna get that out until the actual Halloween party. So Wow Halloween's almost here. It's gone by so fast Seems like it was just yesterday. It was June and people were mad at me. I was decorating for Halloween <laughs> We've been living in this for so long. <laughs> yeah Honestly, we put this up and we just have like what like a week left now or something. So that's great. <laughs> Well, to be fair, that's kind of one of the more labor-intensive things we have to do. Yeah. And then it's Christmas! We don't talk about her, though, yet. <laughs> Not till November 1st. We'll talk about her more, but... Okay, that's it for today's video. I hope you all enjoyed this little 31 days of Halloween vlog of decorating. And like I said, these just literally came from Dollar Tree. So, $1.25 a pack, and we used three. So, not bad. Not bad at all. Three seventy-five. Dollar Tree. No longer a dollar. No longer a dollar. <laughs> I was thinking about, I'm sure there'll be people who'll be like, that 25 cents is how they get you. <laughs> a dollar 25, a dollar. Oh, you don't think about the 25 cents, that's how they get you. <laughs> it adds up, in the 25 before, cents. And before the grandma start commenting. <laughs> that's how they get you. It's, yeah. it's not the food, it's the soft drinks. 287. <laughs> what? It's like what I was told as a kid. Oh, okay. The food will be like 17 bucks for the meal within the two dollar drinks. That's yeah, how they get that's you. That's how they get you. Yeah. <laughs> like okay. <laughs> oh, that's so funny. Anyone else's parents slash grandparents do that too? Probably. You're like barely in frame. Me. <laughs> hey, guys. hey guys, welcome to my video. <laughs> Today we're playing hide and seek. Did you see your nose and mustache? Can you see me? <laughs> <laughs> Okay, that's it for today's video. I hope you all enjoyed. Thank you so, so, so much for watching. Make sure to like, subscribe, hit the notification bell, and all the good stuff, because I'm here every single day in the month of October doing something spooky, scary, or Halloween-related, and you don't want to miss a video. Okay, I'll see miss. you all.
<laughs> I'll see you all tomorrow. Bye.